If you want to turn off the passcode on your iPhone, you'll head to Settings and scroll down the Face ID and passcode. For security reasons, you'll need to type in your current passcode to open this menu, and once you're in, you'll scroll down to the passcode options here. You might notice that the option to turn off passcode is off, depending on how your iPhone is currently configured. In my case, I'm seeing that I'll need to turn off two things, stolen device protection and my face ID. Stolen device protection is right up here, so I'll just turn this off. Stolen device protection adds an extra layer of security in case someone steals your iPhone and they happen to have your passcode. It prevents them from making critical changes to your accounts unless the phone is in a familiar location like your home. Once I have that disabled, I still need to go turn off my Face ID. Scroll up and tap Reset Face ID. Now I can go ahead and turn off my passcode. Turning off passcode will remove cards from Apple Pay to prevent unauthorized purchases. You'll be asked for your Apple account password to confirm the change, and you'll have the option to either keep your saved passwords on your phone or turn off iCloud Keychain and remove all saved passwords. Normally, your phone will require Face ID or a passcode to access saved passwords, so this step is pretty important. I'm going to keep my keychain for now because I am planning to turn my passcode back on after this. And that's it. Now my passcode is disabled, and I can unlock my phone without typing it. This could be useful in some cases, but keep in mind that our phones hold a ton of private info these days, so if you must turn off your passcode, I recommend going through your phone and making sure there's no sensitive data that other people might get access to. As always, leave a comment if you have questions. Like this video if it helped you. And subscribe for more easy guides like this.